I'm joined by Murray Davis, our backline coach. Thanks for joining us, Murray. Uh, firstly, disappointing loss to North on the Mel on the weekend in Melbourne, but it was our start that really let us down. Yeah, it's been a bit of a trend, hasn't it? And, and uh, we've spoken a lot about it and, and we're certainly working through ways in which we can combat that. And it's about yeah, backing up uh, all those things that we've been discussing. So looking forward to uh, addressing that against Essendon this weekend. Uh, Zorko said this morning that it's a lot to do with composure. Would you agree with, with that from the coach's box? Yeah, we do. We feel that um, yeah, we're putting ourselves in positions to be able to win the ball or uh, create the most out of our opportunities, but certainly composure at different stages is, is letting us down. Uh, one of the really tough things for us on the weekend was we lost quite a few players due to injury. How do you think that the guys bounce back from only having really one person on the bench from the second half? Well, they should take a lot out of it because it showed a lot of character and heart from our group and we certainly acknowledge that. So they should take a lot of belief out of that, that they can push themselves and, and that's what we'll be looking to uh, bring against Essendon with a full, hopefully, compliment. And uh, yeah, as I say, a lot of character and heart shown by the players. What was the message from the coaches at, this, at the half-time break to really get the guys to believe? Because we ended up winning that second half by a point. Yeah, it was really just to trust our system and play the way that we want to play. Despite being a few numbers down, we had to adapt. We had to be able to play in different roles and different positions and, and we felt the players really took that on. And, and as you said, we uh, were able to, funnily enough, win the, the uh, second half. Uh, Fag said, you know, this time last year we might have lost a game like that by 20 goals, but we still kicked 12 goals. Can you see a lot of improvement in that 12 months? Yeah, that's, that's right. That's really important to, to take note of. It's the fact that you know, despite some you know, complications in regards to rotations and that type of stuff, we were still able to win our fair share of balls. So um, it's about being able to do it for longer and being able to do it right from the outset. And one of your players, uh, Harris Andrews, had another fantastic game. Just how do you think he's going as a coach? Oh, look, he's had a terrific season. If uh, you know, he gets the best key forward and Ben Brown's a player that we rate really highly and he uh, kicked a goal early and then kicked a, a goal right at the start of the second quarter and then Harris was able to keep him goalless and it was on the back of the guys operating as a unit down back but Harris one-on-one um, -on -one was, I think they went to him 17 times inside 50 so it was a really good job and he's having a good season to date. Yeah, is it crazy to think he's only 21 sometimes? Uh, always, uh, much has been made of his uh, maturity b beyond his age and he puts a lot of work in so it's no real surprise I think but um, yeah he's in really good form. And what do you think the focus is for us uh, this week when we're ahead of our Bombers clash on the weekend? Well it's obviously going to be the start so it's, it's bringing the right attitude and then just being able to consistently do it over four quarters because we've shown we've got capability to be able to, to play the way we want to play and, and really just bring the Gabba crowd into it as well. The boys love playing here at the Gabba so hopefully everyone that gets along gets a, a really good uh, visual on what we're, what we're like when we're at our best. Yeah, definitely. Um, and just on another note, we had Tom Fullerton take part in a training session today. Uh, how do you think he's going to go this year? Oh, it's terrific to see him out there running around with the, the boys and uh, he's a really good size and he moves across the ground really well so it's, uh, he's an exciting prospect and looking forward to seeing him get a few games at the back end of the season. Great, thanks so much Murray and all the best with the preparation this week. Thank you.